Have you guys been experiencing frame drops and low performance in the new Fortnite season? Well, don't you worry, because in today's video, I'm going to show you the 5 best tweaks I have found that drastically give you a huge FPS boost and zero delay in the new Fortnite season. Make sure you guys watch till the end, because I guarantee you these tweaks will boost your performance. Starting off with our first tip, enabling XMP. XMP or Extreme Memory Profile basically allows you to run your RAM at the highest possible speed. This setting has to be turned on in BIOS and does not harm your computer at all. This setting is a must if you want to play games competitively at the highest frames possible with minimal stutters. Make sure you guys watch every second and do not skip a step because for some of you, enabling XMP might be challenging. Okay, so after you guys shut off your PC or restarted it, you're going to want to turn it back on. And you're going to want to press the F2 key, or if you have a 60% keyboard like me, you want to press the FN key and 2 at the same time. Okay, so after a few seconds, you should see this screen pop up. It might be different for you guys, but it usually says BIOS at the top or somewhere. And what you're going to want to do is you want to find the setting that says XMP. You want to click on it and click Enabled. Obviously, I already have it turned on, so we're going to leave it like that. And do not touch anything else. You're gonna to wanna to go down here, save and exit or F10. I would usually just click on it, save changes and reset. Press okay. And there you go. That's how you enable XMP. Moving on to the second tweak, we are going to download ISLC. If FPS stutters are a huge problem for you, then this tweak will certainly help you with these stutters. Okay, so first of all, you guys are going to go to Google, you're going to search up ISLC download, you're going to click enter, you're going to want to click on the first link that pops up. When you're on this link, you guys are going to scroll down all the way until you see official download here, click that. When it's downloaded, you guys are going to drag it onto your desktop, double click it, click extract. When the app extracts, you want to click on the folder, click on Intelligent Standby List Cleaner ISLC, double click on it, click yes. So after you double click on that, this pop-up should show up. And here, what you want to do is you want to look into your total system memory and whatever that number is, you're going to want to split it by half. So let's say you have 8,000, you put 4,000, you have 16,000, you put 8,000, and you have 32,000 like me, you put 16,000. Now you're going to come to the right hand side and you're going to click enable custom timer resolution, click it and for the wanted timer resolution, you're going to put 0 0.50, make sure you delete the extra numbers, click enter. Once you have applied all these settings, you're going to want to click stop, start, and then click purge standby list. After you click that, you can close this off and that's it. Just like the last tip, if you guys want consistent performance and minimal stutters, make sure you guys have the best 3D NVIDIA settings. When you're in your desktop, you're going to right click, go to NVIDIA control panel. Once that opens up, you want to go to manage 3D settings. And here, what you guys are going to do is you're going to copy all of my settings down. Go down slowly. Feel free to pause whenever you guys want. But yeah, pretty easy step. Staying on the topic of NVIDIA, make sure you guys are always up to date with the best NVIDIA drivers. So you guys are going to open Google, search in NVIDIA drivers, click enter. You guys want to click on the second link. Once you click on that, you're going to want to scroll down. So for product series, you guys are going to want to find your graphics card. If you have a 2080, you're going to click the 20 series. If you have a 3080, 30 series. And in my case, I have a 4070, so I'm going to click on the 40 series. If you have a laptop, you're going to want to click on notebook. But if you have a PC, then click on the normal ones. Once you've done that, make sure your product is also on your correct graphics card. I have the 4070. And then you want to click start search. Then what you guys are going to do, you're going to scroll down until you find 
driver version 546.29. This driver is by far the best driver for Fortnite performance. And you guys are going to click get download. Then you're going to click download now. Once that has downloaded, you're going to want to click on it. Click yes. Click OK. Then you want to leave it on NVIDIA graphics driver and GeForce experience. Agree and continue. And here, make sure you guys put custom advanced instead of express recommended. Click next. Options here, you guys want to click perform a clean installation. Once you've done that, click next. And once it's done installing, make sure you guys restart your PC and enjoy the extra frames and zero delay. Finally, our last tweak for today is going to be deleting your temporary files off your PC. So for this next step, you guys are going to go to your search bar, percent, temp, percent, click on the file folder. When you guys are in here, you guys are going to click control A and then delete. Some of you guys have probably never cleaned your temporary files, so doing this step can significantly boost FPS and minimize delay. After following this tutorial, these five tweaks should significantly boost FPS and give you less delay. There are many other tweaks you can do to optimize your PC, but these are the ones that I found to be the most crucial and game changing during my Fortnite games. If this video helped you guys out, make sure to drop a sub and comment if I should drop a similar video like this. Peace.